got some questions for you, Scott. We gonna bury the bull Tell me if you in it or you out. Captain, no, no, no. I know some of y'all have been seeing the drama with Married in Medicine unfolding on social media over the last several months. And yes, it's been really binge-worthy. But now, Bravo has officially released the trailer for season eight, and we've got a lot to talk about. It's Justin Diego back with another binge-worthy video. And today, be sure to watch this video all the way to the very end so that you know everything that you can expect from our other favorite Atlanta wives on the new season of Married to Medicine. Oh my gosh, I just feel like we are really sleeping on Married to Medicine. Time after time, they can be trusted with giving us exactly what they are supposed to be giving us. And with this trailer, it definitely did not disappoint. Great. There is so much going on here and I really don't know where to start, but work with me y'all and let's get through this video together. Now before we get started sipping this tea, go ahead and like this video, click that subscribe button and you already know you want to hit that bell button so you officially join me and my binge watchers and are first to get updates about binge worthy videos like this. Okay, well, first of all, I know that you guys are definitely ready for the new season to start like right now, but the season eight premiere of Mary to Medicine is still several weeks away, but they will be coming through swinging Sunday, March 7th at 9 p.m. on Bravo, and it looks like they've had quite the cast shakeup. Wow! Toya, Dr. Heavenly, Dr. Contessa, Dr. Jackie, and Dr. Simone are all back and looking better than ever. And it looks like we're going to be introduced to a new face named Anaya Saya. Don't know how to say her name just yet, but I'm sure after watching her on the show, I don't know exactly how to say it. Bitch. Oh, hello. <laughs> and they look absolutely stunning in this all cast photo. Mm, 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 mm. Let's get into all this melanin and all this gorgeousness and although everyone looks amazing, I definitely have to give it to Dr. Heavenly for pushing through. She really is the winner here. It's the full body look for me. Yeah, I'm also really excited to see some old familiar faces. Yes, the ones that Dr. Heavenly definitely threw shade at. Lisa Nicole and Carrie Wells, who were both OGs to this show, if I'm not mistaken. And they still look like they got a lot to bring. It's so nice to see them back as friends of the show this season. And it's something that I kind of been wanting for like the last however many seasons it's been since they left. But y'all know, we got to talk about the elephant in the room. Now, although I am not surprised by this tea, I'm actually just as shook as some of y'all are. I know y'all shook because rumors are always just rumors until they're confirmed by the damn press release, right? Mariah, girl. I guess it's official. Yes, I'm talking about the fact that Mariah Huck has gotten the boot again. And to make everything even more messy, her arch nemesis Quad Webb was apparently also demoted to friend of the show. Captain, no, no, no. Now this whole thing is just getting way too messy because back in April of last year, Mariah woke up and decided to choose pettiness when she posted this video on her Instagram feed. The quarantine thing. Hanging out with Dr. Puck this morning, checking the mail. Because I had heard that Married to Medicine contract came out. But mine is not in the mail. So can y'all go check y'all mailboxes to see if my contract came to y'all house? Because what's the thing? Interesting. Yes, Mariah definitely tipped fans off about some possible foul play going down with production, and fans were not feeling it. 
If you've been watching the show since the beginning, you know that Mariah has been a cast member and then she's been demoted, then brought back as a main cast member again. But apparently this time, Bravo isn't featuring her at all. I just think that this is a little strange because although Mariah has not always been like a fan favorite and she can be a bit much at times, she is the one that gave Bravo the idea to make this show in the first place. And it's always just been weird for me to watch her struggle back and forth with the network. I mean, damn girl, Bravo, where's the loyalty? Where's the gratitude? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Now everybody's ganging up against me. For what? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Now, speaking of the struggle, Mariah was one of the people calling for fans to boycott Bravo in a movement led by Nene Leakes, who has been publicly battling with Bravo after allegations of misconduct and discrimination left us shook last year. With Mariah promoting this discussion between Nene Leakes and attorney Crump just a few weeks ago. Now, I find it even more strange because in the trailer, this same man, attorney Brian Crump, is clearly seen talking about social injustices with the cast of this show for this season of Married to Madison. That is the reason why we're marching here in Washington, D.C. Amen. Yeah, that's right. It's getting weird. Am I the only one confused? Because... If he's currently boycotting Bravo and like helping Nini to like spread this awareness and really having us look at Bravo in a really bad light, why wouldn't they just edit him out unless they're okay with what's going on with him and Nini? Like this is just so confusing to me and this is just like messy, messy. Is it just me? <laughs> Well, I don't get paid to figure out Bravo's problems and manage their crisis. <laughs> but, you know, this definitely sounds like a huge Bravo problem. So I'm just going to move right along and give you guys my final thoughts. Married to Medicine is definitely one of those shows that we can count on to bring some really good content. And I would be very surprised if this new season turned out to be a flop. Because although I do have some huge concerns about this new cast shakeup, and I definitely specifically remember telling Bravo not to touch this cast, I still feel like I still am in a place that I feel comfortable telling you guys to give them a chance. So comment right now and let me know how you guys are feeling about the new season of Mary to the Mess, season eight. That's what I'm gonna be calling it from now on. <laughs> Saddle up for some fun shade headed your way Sunday nights when season 8 of Married to Medicine, aka Married to the Mess, premieres March 7th at 9 p.m. only on Bravo. Thanks so much for watching this video all the way to the end. Please like and subscribe to Binge Ready to keep watching more Binge Ready videos like this one. And if you want me to start making more regular Married to the Mess updates, holla at your boy in the comments. Thanks again for watching this video. I will see all y'all messy doctors and doctors wise on the next one.